What is going on YouTube? It's me Andy the Kid and today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to use Cubby. Now what Cubby does is that it allows you it's pretty much like Dropbox, it's a Dropbox alternative, so it's pretty cool and more it gives you more options than Dropbox gives you. But here yeah, here is Cubby. You can I'll have the download link in the description for you to go and download it. So right off the bat you get five gigs, five gigs of free online storage space. And um, here's how you use the program. So when you open it up, you see this white window. And it says Cubby at the top. And um, to add to to um, add stuff to your Cubby, all you have to do is just drag folders and just drop them right here. You drag the folder, you drop it. Then Microsoft Office Enterprise, it's gonna sync. Click sync. It's already synced. And then there you go. You then afterwards, after you have dragged it, after it syncs, and let's wait for it. After it syncs and it's like one of these ones, uh, you want to click on link and then check link for public, link public, public link for my cubby. And you download the, you right click on the link, copy and you send it to your friend. So when they go on the web browser, they enter the link that you gave them and it goes to right there. It shows you everything that you have in that folder. So this is my cubby folder. Let me open it right here on my computer to show you that I have it. This is my cubby folder and it has Bioshock 2 with game saves in it. Let's open it up. See what all the game saves. And the ISO so it's Ubuntu 12.04. Go back to my cubby ISO Ubuntu 12.04 so it's, it's pretty much the same thing on on your desktop as it's in, as it's, as it is in the web browser. So when you give people the link, you can they can download stuff from your cubby right away. And it's free for right now and it's easy to use. So I hope you guys check it out and enjoy the app. It's been your boy Andy the Kid. Later.